guys, welcome back to stage 10, issue 10, whatever you want to call it. It's again more engine accoutrements, uh, but they are necessary things. So this month we're going to be doing uh, some brackets on the front, uh, the building, the generator, pulley, and its supports, uh, fitting the water pump housing, uh, and the oil filter assembly. So slowly but surely, this is all coming together. Uh, I've laid out all our screws. We've got FM, EP, DP, GP. BP, and then we have these little, uh, I guess, fittings for your, your tubes there. So to start our build here, we just take one of our FM screws here, and it is going to extend through the bracket this way. And it's going to go right into this piece here. So this bracket should look like this about. So I'm not gonna tighten the screw anymore. If we need to tighten it later on, uh, we can. He says as he tightens it just a little bit more, um, but it's still maneuverable so we can get it in the right final position. And then we're gonna take two of our EP screws here. And we come to the front of the engine here and it's going to mount in place just like this on the engine. There we go, so now we've got that done. We're gonna go ahead and take this piece here. We're going to take this piece here. And there is that keying feature again. You want it to look like this. And then we take the front piece like this. And then, finally, so when it comes to the actual generator pulley here, uh, I'm not sure if it's supposed to be spaced like that for the belt that looks right, but like the instructions kind of show it together like this, uh, which is strange, like when you look at it here, like that looks like it's right near each other, that looks like it's right together, and that looks like it's right together. It doesn't look like it gets the same gap that I get, which ends up making this look more correct, but I'm not really sure. So I don't know, maybe later on it's gonna have to be changed, but that seems more correct to me to actually allow space for the belt, uh, even though this piece doesn't push in quite all the way, uh, and then you connect it like that. So this is possibly subject to change because it doesn't push in any more than that, but the the actual blades are going the wrong way if you do it the other way so i am not sure what the deal is anyway let's fasten it together with that in place we're going to take our little bracket here and secure it with an ep goes right through the top and then that goes right here And I just realized we forgot to put on our little pieces here from the previous step. So we're going to take them all, make sure that they're looking the right way, and just plug them right into the top here. There we go. So with that all in place, we come back to our bracket here. So this guy is going to take an FM, we're going to put it through here, 
and into this bracket. Once that's in place, we're going to take this and swivel it down here where it needs to go. So we can use an EP and get it into that hole down there. So there we go, we've got that piece done. Next we're gonna take our G piece over here, we need three of them. And we're gonna take our water pump housing, and we're gonna come back to the front here, and make sure that we get it keyed the right way, and once it is there, it should sit in there pretty nicely. So that was an interesting part to put in because it makes you wonder why you put this in so late when you put all this stuff on top of it, but whatever. So we're gonna go on to our final part here. We take this piece here, it goes right through the back. Uh, again, keyed to go in the way it needs to be. This comes through here like that. We're gonna take our DP right here. And we'll fasten that in place. And then this guy, and this is where our oil filter is, is gonna come through right here. And we don't do both of these screws. One is gonna sit here and one's gonna sit here um, because we're gonna need it for later. But we're gonna pick our BP screw here. And we'll get that last one put in place. And there we go. That is concluding issue 10. Uh, we got our oil filter, we've got our generator. I'm gonna look it up to see what I can see based on uh, this like pulley. Like it looks right to me seeing it in person here, but it doesn't look right when I compare it to the figures. So I'm gonna take a look, see what I can find. And uh, you know, if we need to address it in a later video, we will. So until then, this has been T2RX6. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. See you next time.